Mondelez International. What a great place to work. The products we provide the world are second to none. We are a household name. Every home most likely has something made by Nabisco or Cadbury. We should be proud of what we do. When you share an Oreo with your family or neighbors, it always brings a smile. Our motto for safety at Mondelez is work, play, live, safe. As the motto indicates, safety is not something we do just at work. Safety must be a part of us. It is a way of life. No one wants to see their child or loved one get hurt or worse. It is the same with your spouse, friends, and children. They do not want to see you get hurt at work. The key is to think and act safely in all we do so we can continue to do the activities we enjoy in life. Nothing we do is worth taking a shortcut or bypassing safety and risk getting injured. Since we work for such a great company such as Mondelez, we want to show you how the product is made and how critical your role is in the whole process. We also want to show our DSD network and retail and how the product gets on the shelf. Let's take a look at what goes on in, at Mondelez to make sure that our product is in every home globally and how critical your role is in making that happen safely. I feel personally responsible for my whole team. I worry about all of them. I've met their families and I would hate to know that they went home injured or otherwise to their families. And making sure that all my guys go home safe, I also make sure that I go home safe. I've got a son and a daughter at home that I love more than anything and we have a blast camping, skiing, everything outdoors, playing hockey, riding bikes and we make sure that we always do that safely so that we can continue doing it as well wearing all the proper protection and pads that we need for whatever we're doing. Hi, I'm Leonard Thompson in Greensboro, North Carolina. And the reason why safety is important to me, simple, my family. I want to get home every day to them, and they want me home with them. Thank you. Um, safety to me means everybody going home, enjoying family life, um, quality of life, 
and to continue that. Just a great benefit to go home all one piece and enjoy life. I guess the biggest thing for safety is for me is I uh, I do this because my family, you know, I, I got them to come home to and I love them. I can't, I can't afford to get hurt. I gotta take care of them. Folks, we really already know why we need to work safely. We can talk all day about change, about being the safest company in the world. We need to start by being the safest person that I can be in the world first, then have the courage to help others make safer choices. We all can make a difference, starting with ourselves. Hi, my name is Tim Liga and I, along with my team, help support safety for the CSNL network. I'd like to begin by thanking each of you for the safety accomplishments over the past few years. Despite the large reduction in the number of accidents that we've seen, we still have a long ways to go in our safety journey to become an accident-free workplace. Uh, I think what I want to do next is, uh, is share something from the head and the heart. Um, many, many years ago, as a young supervisor uh, with Nabisco, I, had, I lost the driver to a head-on collision early one morning while he was on his way to his first delivery stop. Um, I'll never forget receiving the phone call from the South Carolina Highway Patrol informing me that we had a, uh, one of our trucks involved in a serious accident and that the driver was deceased. I'll never forget going to uh, tell the wife that her husband was not going to be coming home that day or ever. I'll never forget being at the funeral and observing the, um, seeing the mom and uh, the two young uh, girls uh, see their, uh, their dad be buried and uh, not be there for them uh, for the rest of their life. 
uh, it left an impression on me that uh, has never left me in my entire career. Uh, what I'd like to uh, challenge each of us uh, with today is uh, to think about the impact of the decisions and the actions that we do every single day, every single hour. I would like you to think about the action, impact that it has, not only on yourself, but on your coworkers uh, that work around you. Uh, think about the impact that it has on uh, your family and your friends, the folks that, uh, that love you and are depending on you to come home. Think about the impact that you're potentially having on the people that you just randomly come in contact with today, folks that you uh, may not ever see again in your life. I'd like to challenge all of us to uh, keep that in the front of our mind as we go through it, uh, through that thought process every day. When the school bus driver pulled out in front of the fully loaded tanker truck, which subsequently uh, went around a curve and hit her driver head on, the impact of that individual's decisions had a profound impact on many, many lives forever. Uh, so my ask of uh, each of you today, as we embark on this day and uh, the days to come, is to keep that in the forefront, that uh, the impact of all the uh, actions we take, all the decisions we make every day, it does matter. So thank you for the uh, for your commitment to work safe. Thank you for the uh, the improvements that we're going to see in 2015. I look forward to working with each of you.